Man, I can't believe the mechanic never showed up, James. Not, now you've got to fix I, the AC. Yeah, I can. Can you give me some water? I'm thirsty. Uh, okay. Okay, there should be water in the mini fridge. All right. Huh? Sounded like a knock. I should go answer it. Hello. I'd like to speak to James Osborne. Oh. Actually, he's on the roof fixing the air conditioner. In fact, I was getting him some water. Well, could you please get him? I need to speak with him. Why do you need to speak to him so badly? Because it's important. Hey, my guy fix the air conditioner. Where's my water? I have my trident. It's a Isaac. I mean, uh. Could you please have a seat? Of course. Uh, I gotta deal with James. James? Oh, yes. What is wrong with you? What do you mean, what's wrong with me? Every time a you female walks into your sight, you just freeze up and, and you try to you, stab whoever you see. You... You brought that creature into the house. What do you mean, creature? Who even is that? That's... How could you even ask me something like that? Because I don't know who she is, and it sounds like you know. She's my mother. What? <sighs> I'm bored. I think it's time to film an episode of Easy Collapse. James, if you don't tell me what the problem is, we can't solve it. I don't want to solve it. I just want to run away from it. That's never the right way to solve problems, James. I just said I don't want to solve it. We're solving it. Get out there! Get out there! We're fixing this problem right now. Get over here. I don't want to do this. Don't worry, I'll do the talking. James, get in the chair now. Have a seat. Have a seat! I uh, never got your name. What is it? It's Jackie. Jackie Osborne. Oh my god, you are his mother. So... He told you. Th that's all he told me. He didn't tell me anything else. Uh, I don't know what has gotten into that boy's head. W what are you talking about? You scarred me for life. W what are you talking about? I don't I'm know how she could have you. scarred you. She scarred me for life. Alright, alright. Tell me what happened. It all happened when I was five. Me and my mother here went to the mall to buy some donuts, of course. So, um, well, we bought our stuff, and we were on our way back when I lost my mother, so I went looking for her, and she, I saw her in an alleyway. She was holding a gun, and then there was a dead man next to her. She looks at me, and starts coming towards me, so I go and hide in a nearby alleyway. Another alleyway? Yes. Okay. So, I'm hiding when she finds me and she's like, I found you. Where have you been? And I'm like, ah, ah. And then she, she said she informed me that she called the police. They came and asked me what happened. And I said that my mother killed a man. So then they arrested her. Um, wait, arrested? Shouldn't you be in prison? Uh, James, the, the prison burned down. So you escaped illegally. Well, I was nearly burnt to a crisp, you know. So Mike, listen to me. Everything James said was true. Except I didn't do it. Uh, what do you mean? It sounds like he saw you do it. I saw her do it. What? Are you saying it was like a shapeshifter? Yes, she clearly had red hair. And as you can see, I do not have red hair. Oh. She obviously died in prison. Oh, James, what color was her hair earlier that morning? It was brown. So everything he said is true, except for the fact that it was a shape-shifting villain who is still out there, I must add. No one has caught them, but they're still out there. Oh, wow. Hmm. James. Yes. Sounds like we have another mystery to solve. I guess you're right. Maybe one day.
Wait a minute. How did you find us anyways? So this greaseball came up to me and was like, Hello, would you like to assist me in taking down the Agents of Fortune? And I was like, who are the Agents of Fortune? So he pulls out his phone and it's covered in Cheeto dust. Let's take a look at this. He starts playing some commercial. I see James in it. Or Ed. So he's like, Help me kill them. And I'm like, are you crazy? Get, get out of here. Wait, could you tell us what the man looked like? Uh, he was wearing a brown jacket. We also had a fedora and glasses. Uh... James. Yeah. The photo. You're right. She basically described the guy in the photo. Agreed. Jackie. Yes? Did he ever tell you his name? Oh yeah! When I told him no, he got real close to me and said, Say my name. I was like, I don't even know your name! And he says, This was Shiro. Now say my name! And I said no! And he got angry and ran off! Oh. Well, James? Looks I like guess. we know who to search for. I guess you're right. Also apologize to your mother! What? For Apologize! What? Oh, I'm sorry. Well, that sounded forced. But I accept your apology. Jackie, you look tired. Should be getting some rest. You're right. I hope you boys can catch him. Oh, trust me. We will. Alright. No, I gotta go. I gotta go! Well, James? Yeah. Looks like we gotta start searching for Walt. I guess we do. Hey guys, how are you? How, how are you oh, doing? Oh Keith, uh, hi. It's been a while. Did you dye your hair? What? I what? No, 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 no. All right, then. No, anyways, uh, we got a spider. thing for you to do. You got, you got a thing. Yeah, what I is it? I think we know who took James Mintz. Who took him? Some guy named Walt Shiro. Oh my god, guys! It's Walt Shiro from Breaking Good! What? Uh, Don't worry, I've, I've recently got into a really big fixation with 3AM videos. How about uh, we make a video where we break into the Kardashians' house? What? No! What? no. J j no. Just go out and look for him, please. You're, you're scaring mean, me. Okay, then! Why would we break into a low-level place like the Kardashians? Hey. Ooh. I, uh... I was wondering if you could help me with something. Wow! Oh my god, guys, look at him! He looks older than my grandpa! <laughs> Man, you're crazier than me. I'm out of here. We. <laughs> Yo, hey, Walt. Boss! I got something to tell you. What is it? We. Ah! Why am I in so much pain? Don't worry about it. Uh, keep doing what you're doing, and make sure all the stuff you do is very obvious. It's uh, Villain 101. Okay, boss. I think I'm sterile.